Hey everybody, I hope you're having a good day today. Today I want to go over something that uh, a lot of Linux content creators have been touching on, but I want to go at it in a different angle. A lot of people have been talking about snaps, flat packs, app images, and pretty much explaining to the Linux community out there what the difference is. But what I really want to touch base on is package management as a whole in Linux and what's going to happen here in the future that's going to make Linux more friendly for other users. Now, if you are a Linux purist, generally, whether you're using Debian, Arch, whatever distro you're using, you're going to install whatever you want to use from the terminal. And that's not a problem. I install things from the terminal all the time. But at the same time, if we want to welcome more people into Linux that don't quite have a grasp on the terminal yet, we've got to have a good, easy way for them to install software. Now, on my Tuxedo laptop here, the Tuxedo OS, I do have the Discover Software Center. I can go through here and pretty much download 80 to 90% of what I use on a daily basis. And then there's other things that I have to download a flat pack of. Uh, Mailspring right here, for example, I use as a flat pack. Now, flat pack, what's interesting about it here, let me close this and let me open something up real quick. What Flathub wants to do in and of itself is make a universal Linux app for all Linux distributions. Right now it's available, I believe, on over 35 right out of the box, but you can install it on any system. Now, one of the reasons I love flat packs is unlike snaps, which are pretty much handcuffed to just Ubuntu-based operating systems. I mean, you probably could get them installed on other ones, but this one's just ingrained into a corporation. It's ingrained into Canonical, and it's something that Canonical wants to put out in front of everybody to just say, use it, use it, use it, but it's got a corporation at its base. With flat packs, you've got uh, people from GNOME that are involved, people from KDE that are involved. It's just, it's it's such a different open platform that you will be able to use. Now, a lot of people will say they don't like flat packs because the application is so big. This is another thing I do like about flat packs. When you download the application, all the dependencies that are required for that application are downloaded in the container with the application. What that gives you an advantage of is that application is running from one sole container. It's not getting into your base operating system, so it's going to be more secure, more stable, and it may take a little longer to start up, but that's okay. It doesn't really matter. Uh, unless I'm on my, my phone, I don't really need an app to start up in two seconds. So that's just me, or milliseconds. But Flathub wants to be the universal app store across Linux, and it's got a lot of people backing it. Like I said, I use Discover on my Tuxedo OS. Don't have a lot of problems with it, but it has had stability issues in the past, and it doesn't play friendly with other distributions. And then you do have PayMac, which is developed by Manjaro, that some people do decide to put on Arch Linux distributions. There's just some problems with it. It's not perfect either. And nothing really is in Linux. Nothing is ever perfect, but I mean... There's things in Mac OS and Windows that aren't perfect either. But I do believe if we come out with a universal Linux app store that it would be successful. Here's the reason I believe this. And here's the reason a lot of people um, have been writing about it. Is the fact that it's something that's secure and stable, for one. It's a centralized location where app developers can upload their apps and also be able to take donations, get feedback, take bug reports. It's all in one place. And I know the Microsoft Store is a joke. We all know that. Anybody that's ever been around it on Windows knows it's a joke. The iTunes Store is kind of a locked down, integrated thing. But I do believe having flat packs in one centralized location on any Linux distribution opens up the world to possibilities. Now, I am going to have, like I said, the purists out there that are going to watch this video and go, Troy, you're crazy. Just stick with this. Stick with that. I don't have a problem with that. And I don't think you... That's the beauty of this, is no matter whether they put it out there or not, you don't have to use it. You can continue using what you want to use. But I do believe with Linux being, you know, 
the foundation of the web, the foundation of basically all business servers. It's ingrained into the business, but we still haven't quite got a grasp on the desktop yet. I believe something like a universal app store that, that Flathub or Flatpak could do would be a great thing. So if you're new to Linux and you go download uh, a distribution and you put it on your system and you go software and you pull up software and there's the flat hub right there and you can pretty much scroll through and get anything and whatever you might need i think it's a plus but i wanted to do this video what do you guys think your linux users how do you install your applications do you think something like a universal app store would be awesome in linux personally i do if you disagree or if you agree please put that down in the comments below do me a favor before you leave today please like the channel Likes keep me in YouTube's algorithm, which means if you found the information in this video helpful, somebody else out there might as well. And subscribe. Doesn't cost anything. And if you end up not liking me, you can always unsubscribe. As always, thank you for watching my video, and I will see you in the next video.